Hi, this is Jack. This is the Spiral Flat Pulse Motor, and I've wound a new flat spiral flat coil from number 22 wire from instructions that um, Jiffy Coil gave. And thanks, much thanks to uh, Jiffy Coil for doing that. Here's my uh, coal bowl little rotor motor, and we have the um, driver circuit and a little charge thing here, charge capacitor and light. And then here is a schematic for people that are interested in that. Notice that the uh, hall sensor is a negative going pulse and that the buffer transistor just buffers it and the, um, the MOSFET when power is applied is normally on so it will be conducting through the coil. So then when the pulses come in from the hall sensor it will turn the uh, MOSFET on and off and pulse the coil. The coil, both the windings of the coil are um, um, on or in series. So it's only 22 gauges of, um, so I'm going to try to um, get this thing set up here with one hand and um, show you its performance with only uh, the small amount of copper the thing has in there. So let's get that out of the way and uh, get the hull sensor in a little cup and get uh, some power applied to the thing. Here we go. And there we go. It's uh, sort of out of control here. So there it is. It's a lot of power for uh, <laughs> for this thing um, for a small amount of coil. So thanks a lot for watching, and thanks to Jiffy Coil.